Hey. Yeah, I might might need to fuck a bit with the audio. Maybe. I don't know. Probably help if I connected my controller, eh? That would be a good idea. <laughs> right. Uh, this is quite loud in old guy's ears. Please let this fucking run okay. Please let this... I'm just always very wary about fucking PC streaming. You know, you can't what I'm like. Hello. Tofna, top tier mate. Dark one, dagger. Uh, I didn't get to see all the dev stream. I had to dip out to start, you know, preparing. For this, uh, subtitles on sync to audio. Sync to audio. Here is the is the is the music too loud? You know, is the the ambience the ambience? Uh, that's fine. That's whatever. Controls. I trust you. Sounds fine. Uh, my worry is that I might have to fucking tab out. I'll need to tab out to adjust the... Do you know what? I'll need to see if I can actually set up some buttons here on my stream deck that I can... I'm pretty sure I can do that where I can, on the stream deck, put the specific bits of audio louder or quieter. Surely. Right, here we go. So the center image is barely visible. Right, I don't know about you, but that's barely visible to me. That's barely... That will do me nicely. You can always fuck with it in the options if it's not right. Yep, subtitles. This is observe Observation, by the way. An illicit observer. That's another game that I, I quite enjoyed. This is made by Scottish people. So it must be good. Let's just set the tone here. We are sipping on um, sugar free sprite. Bar. Please hold hold the big patter. Hold on to that big patter for later. <laughs> Man, I'm worried this is gonna be too loud. Panicking. It's doing a fair bit of fucking loading in it. I oh you know that's something I should take into consideration if somebody's watching the stream. This game has an epilepsy warning. A big one. Big fan of this loading. I am not worried at all about this loading. Mm-hmm. Pressing buttons. I'm pressing buttons and nothing's happening. Please? <laughs> mm, please? <laughs> Andy, is this normal? <laughs> Andy's played this. He might not have played it on 
PC though, that might be what's fucking. This is a uh, the PC version. It's having a big think. I just like uh, I. Well, I mean, see if it is one big load. I like when it at least says, you know, this may take some time, because then you're all right. But when it's when the bar has been full for a couple of minutes and nothing's happening, you get the big fear. The panic sets in. The fear takes hold, and that's how they get you. Right, music, music altogether has stopped. Usually it shouldn't take long enough for the the ambient music to stop. Okay, do you know what? I might fucking... I might try and come out of this and start that again. Let's, um, let's just get rid of you. It's not worrying in the slightest, eh? Let's fucking try that again. Hmm. What do I want? Oh, the bus. I'm just I'm pressing buttons and moving shit around. Right, let's try that again. Fingers fucking crossed. Good start, eh? Good start to the old stream. This time, please. Please. There's your epilepsy warning. Resume game. So as far as they're concerned, I started the game. Let's hit new. Let's go for that. Yep. No. Please. Don't fuck me. Please. Boo. It's one of them. No, I don't think it is one of them much. Here we go. <laughs> Already on New Game Plus. Yes. Okay. So we were hearing this, but the loading screen stayed up. And now I'm worried I should be seeing something here and I'm no. Oh, thank fuck, right, it's doing one of them. Right, low orbit space station observation, 410 kilometres above Earth. Liking that the light coming in with every rotation it's staying in the big spin. Houston, I have no response from Sam. I just thought it was a quite good because it's no revealing. Oh Sam? Got a wee fright. Sam, are you there? Oh, come on, come on, come on. Oh, come on. I think I am Sam. So I'm the computer boy. Sam I am, right. Emma Fisher, voice print errors detected. 
Aye, well, she's having a hard time getting her communications Great. through. Thanks, Sam. That's good. Come on. Man, this aesthetic is fuck. It's just Sam. Bang on. Are you there? Respond. Oh, nice. Right, hold LT enter response mode. So, respond to that. Yeah. Oh, nice. Thank God. Okay, okay, okay. Now we're getting somewhere. Okay. Sam, you seem to have booted up in module 8. I'm going to relocate you to the Horizon Utility Hub in module 9. That should give you access to limited system diagnostics. Hang on. Great. Listen, I'm stuck in the Horizon airlock in Module 11. I need to get into 9, but I'm not sure if it's safe to open this hatch door. Can you give me hull and pressure diagnostics on Module 9? Module 9. Right. Pressure safe powers low, hull contacts true, system links connected. Uh, so module nine is fully pressurized. Okay, that's good. Good. Are the adjacent contact points from nine intact? Module nine hull contact points to adjacent modules read true. Good, we're still connected. Oh, I'm into this. Very into this. Uh, something is vibrating, Sam. Can you check the whole contact points on the other modules? Module 10, hull contact points to 12, read false. Suggesting that module 12 is no longer securely attached to the station. Shit. I think Josh might have been in module 12. Eee? Okay. Poor Josh. I'm coming through to nine. Sam! The hatch door is jammed shut! The controls aren't responding. See if you can restore power. Sam, you still there? What am I getting? Sam, what is that? Sam, a response! What the hell is going on? Fuck me, man. Bring her. She unconscious? So it's what literally bring her. Oh. There you go. self-diagnostic procedure and what errors are you showing right diagnostic relocation network error memory core error crew tracker error you'll see when I'm talking just making sure my PC fan isn't coming through is it because it's Fuck me, man. Just taking, just I'm taking a single headphone off here, and it's a loud bitch. Hmm. Okay.
Auto relocation network is non operational. Crew assist required. Right, so she will need to fix that. Relocation functions are offline. I require auto routing to access module cameras. Okay. I can manually relocate you, but once I get out of here, I'll get your systems up and running. Right. Memory core. Right, so sweep individual cores. Five percent degradation. Eighty-three. Eighty-seven. Man, is this one gonna be fucked? Aye. Oh, need a separate. Okay. So. The main memory core has been corrupted. I have lost significant station data. Okay. So most of your system links and data logs are gone. Sam, you will need to scan, download, and recover as much data as you can. We need to get you back to your old self. Right. So I'm not myself. I'm not even my usual cheery self. Right, crew identification network's done. Sensor array. Right, that works. Check our power status monitor. Good. Vitals and life parameter sensors. Good. So. The vital sign telemetry component is online. Oh, great. What isn't working? The connection between crew tracker functionality and SAM OS has been severed. So it's working, but the link is cut. I'll need to reconnect it in Central. Josh? May? I think Josh Anyone? is away on that, that bit that's not connected to the station anywhere, pal. Okay. Yeah. I can't get out of here. The hatch controls aren't working. It might be a safety lockdown. You'll have to override the hatch from Module 9. Okay. I'm auto routing you back to the utility hub in module nine. Mm. Camera movement should be online now. Run a test. Oh good. Looks good. Camera cycling should be active as well. Check the other cameras. Oh, I'm right. into that effect. That's cool. I can see your live feed updating from here. There should be a system links reset procedure document on the wall somewhere in there. Find it and scan it. Your scan system range is limited, so use your camera zoom to get closer. Position. Somewhere's procedure system link reset shows terminal input code TIC that allows. Crew, remember to reset some system like functionality in the event of a software failure. Warning, this procedure will require a reconnection to all system links station wide. Only perform after a f after a full reset. Okay. That should be reinstalling the system link interface. Use your cameras to locate the hatch controls and any other integrated systems and equipment. Offline that laptop. I need to be at another angle. Oh no! Aye, sorry, I was, I was getting fucked up with the perspective there. Right, no, that one. Hmm. Hey, what have we got here? CO2 refill station, combustion unit, sphere modification. Right, for that sphere that's on the table. Uh, 
closer to the airlock. I've already connected to that. Hatch control, there we fucking go. Okay, now add the EAS-11 airlock hatch controls. Add the EAS-11 hatch controls. So do I do that via this? Oh no wait, ES11. So do I, ah there we go. Okay, it looks like that is working. Now use your system link interface to open the EAS11 airlock. Uh, so Yes. It's open. I'm out. Good work, Sam. I like this. Okay. Let's get this up and running. Josh, I don't know if you can hear me, but oh, I hate these things. Emma, hello. Josh. If you're in EAS Module 12, then stay put. The hull connection isn't secure, and most of our systems are underpowered. I'll work something out. Josh? Houston? Anyone? Sam, our internal communication network is fully online. Where has everyone gone? Oh, you're the only one, for sure. Oh, shit. Oh, okay, station station alerts. Right, Sam, you should have access to your OS now. By clicking pause. Oh fuck me. Okay. In the EAS arm at least. Try it now. Find that fire, Sam. Is it doing there with the right hold on? Wait. Fuck me. Hold on. Fire, fire, I'm looking for a fire. This is wild. It'll be in here then. Uh, right, I found it. Uh, what did I do? Open the... Aye. I think if I open the hatch, I can maybe fuck with it. Fuck, it's locked. Wait, schematic? Okay. Um. Right, yes, fire, correct. Is there a system? Change angles. Ah, what are you? Environment sensor. Wait, can I do it from? Right, it's there that's got it. Wait, do I need to? Ah, wait. If I'm looking at it, do I need to tell her about the fire? There is a fire. They are I right. In EAS4. Shit, I'm on my way. Wait, don't come here. This is wild, man. Just, I, I'm just really kind of in love with the whole look and aesthetic and style they're going for. Wait. I'll need to let her through, won't I? Like, is she moving in real time? 
Oh! That helped in there. No. Oh, right, it's telling me where she is. I see. Sam? The hatch in EAS 6 is locked down. Can you get it open for me? I've got you. Oh shit, it's locked. Uh, schematic? Uh, other side of it maybe? So go into five. Look for the... Does that work? It's open. Come yeah. On Relocate to AS3. I'll need your help okay. when I get there. Uh, three, 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 three. Right, what are we doing? I'm assuming we're going to like open an airlock in, um, in number four. Remove the oxygen, remove the fire. Fucking door. Wait. One, two, three. Wait, hold on. What, what, what door? Hell, Sam, on three. What door in hen? Is it this one? Shit, Sam, Wait. On three, open the bloody door. You mean you need me in here to open this door? Oh, I'll do it myself. No, ah, oh, fuck on. me. They give me any trouble. Here. Right. Hold on. Hold on. Let's just talk for a wee minute, right? She said she needed me in EA3. I needed to be in EA4 to open that fucking hatch. I was correct. Um Vents. Clear these fumes. Uh, vents, vents, vents. Environment sensor? No. Uh, hmm. What the fuck are the vents, man? Oh, do you mean in here? Food... Uh, food prep... Where the fuck are the vents, man? Hold on, hold on. Du -du 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 -du. Sorry, I'm just, I'm looking at my... The legend for the, the map. Bonk. Set clear waypoint. So I'm just getting a an idea for what's going on. Oh shit! What's this? All oh, right, that shit that I've remembered for the corrupted data. Vents. I feel like I'm missing a really obvious bit. Oh. Use a laptop, maybe? Oh, Jesus. What? See that? All good up here. Message for home, please, Sam. Hey, guys, it's like... I just went by Florida and I saw Jacksonville all lit up. It never gets old and... Well, I just wanted to say hey. 
Things are great up here, and work is going smoothly. Although Houston keeps changing their minds on what they want me to focus on. I'm hoping I'll get more info soon, though. Still, it's all good. Message ends, Sam. Okay. Well, that's good. I should be looking for doing things like that with laptops. Emma, any chance of enlightening me? Enlightening me to the, the location of some vents? Food, I keep thinking that says food wanker. What? What the fuck was that? Vent? There's a vent. Emma, there's vents everywhere here. Do you mean in this room? Because... Please repeat your previous request. Well, I don't want to move inside. Vent the fumes first, Sam. Aye, so it's definitely in here. Is it fucking... Maybe it's no in this room. Oh! Oh no, that's just the hatch control. It's no that. I can't actually do anything with that. It fucking must be in another the room next to it. Unless I'm going mental. This is... What the fuck am I missing? This is... G oh, fuck me, man. Okay. That's it, it's working. The fumes are dissipating now. How bad is it? The rack units have been damaged beyond any functional use. Overall, that's not too bad, considering. What started it? What was the source, Sam? We need to stop it happening again. The source looks like Residue that panel. Panel L F E one indicates a potential source. What? That's just a blank plate. Let me see. Something is coming out of the side. It's like a thick grease. Don't just or touch oil. it with your fuck. You never seen an alien right. film. There is maybe something in storage above that's leaking. Oh, come on. What now? Sam, give me uh -oh. some support. What's happening? Severe stress on the area. That's the bit that was broke, was it? No. Stress being applied to EAS 12. So it wasn't broken away. So that Rhythmic. Jacob fella might be in there. No, Josh. Please, if there is anyone in Model Twelve, make yourself known now. We are about to jettison the module. Someone, please respond. This is getting much worse. <sighs> okay. Sam, get ready for the separation procedure. First, process my authorization code and give me a security override key. 1442 413324. Oh, fuck. Hold on, I fucked it in. Sam, come on! 
Oh, don't say it again. I fucked it in. That doesn't look good. EAS-12 is still tethered with unusual structural damage. It's like a hole has been... cut out of it. What would do that? Eh, uh, what else would go at? Calmness fucked. Uh, I think that's the things I already reported, so maybe next one in. Ah. Me man, that's Saturn. How did we get here? Wait, the course was set for Saturn. Initiated by initiated by fucking me. I you here. It seems. Fucking signal. Signal accepted. Wait. Was this the bring her? So the whole time she was unconscious, was that us coming here? There it fucking is. Know. Oh, this is good. No code. Give it up for fucking no code. Mm. 
Andy, how do I know that fucking name, man? Fuck me, that's who that is. I wouldn't have guessed that. I know, I know that fucking name, but I wouldn't have, I wouldn't have reached that fucking conclusion. Christ! Look at this man. No, Stina, that's the, that's the titles. Oh, look how fucking wee it is. <laughs> look how tiny it is. I restarted your core systems. Sense. And to be quite honest, I'm fucking terrified right now. But anyway, without you, I'm not going anywhere, so welcome back. Okay, first off. Let's try this again. Sam, voice authenticate. Dr. Emma Fisher, 140412. I like that it still... It still lets me choose that. Okay. Okay. So, Sam, here's the deal. I'm stuck in the EAS arm for now. I think it's related to power, but a lot of the hatches are fully locked down, so I'm going to try something different here. Oh, that's that sphere thing. Okay. That's audio, at least. Almost there. Just a sec. Wait, is she, like, transferring me to the sphere so she can carry me about? Shit. Sam, I have rigged a connection sphere for you to use. You should be able to take control of this and fly around the station. Oh, I've got it. Let Fuck. You parts of the station your cameras can't see, and it will let you wirelessly connect to non-station devices, like laptops. I wasn't expecting that. I was genuinely... Good, I thought this was going to be a, okay. you know, a fixed camera only type deal. Let's see if you can move it. Fly over to me. Great. Now turn around 180 degrees to face me and fly back. Good. There are more controls for translation and rotation, but I'll let you figure them out. You should still be able to identify objects and relay information to me like any other camera. Try it now. Uh, I'm locking it. The Sphere CO2 refill station is online. Okay, great. That works. Now, you can release yourself from the sphere and return to your main OS just like before. Try it now. 
Sphere tracking is online, so its location will be displayed on your station map. Cool. To reconnect to your sphere, you can either quick connect directly from your map, or you can use a nearby module camera to access it. Reconnect to your sphere now. Right. Let's test out your sphere connection systems. Connect to the laptop above the workbench. Once you're connected, attempt to download whatever data is left. Put it above the workbench. Oh man, fuck, I didn't... Wait. Then I realised I was at that mad angle. Wait. What way's fucking up? Ah, right, she's sideways. Okay. This one. Best practice. Guidance spheres, best practice. Development and control of microgravity guidance spheres and observation is overseen by Dr. Emma Fisher. Operation interface for guidance spheres can be found through a graphical user interface that can be located at crew member workstations and is planned upgrade to the existing SAM system during the observation mission. Guidance spheres are prepared by short harmless emissions of CO2 and allow the user to inspect and repair both internal and external ship apparatus. Microgravity guidance spheres are still at the experimental stage. Great. Can't believe that all actually worked. Right. So, the rest of the station is dark and the horizon arm is running on emergency power. The solar panels give us next to nothing this far from the sun. However, we do have an experimental fusion reactor on board. The EFR. If that can generate enough power, we can maybe get the universal hatches open. See what you can do. I'll try to find a way to contact the rest of the crew. Right, shit, man, this is cool. What am I doing? Experimental fusion reactor access ES1. Uh, what one am I in the new? I'm in nine, so I'm coming down. And then I'm taking a right. Wait. Did I go the wrong? Oh, they connect like that. Aye, aye. I'm gonna need. Like, why would I just assume they're in a fucking straight line? This is mad, man. That one's off. So is that. Storage bag. Can I do? Oh, I can't do anything with them anyway. I've no even got, like, arms or shit. Okay. Man, I really never expected this kind of, um, movement shit. I really just wasn't a... Oh, good. Sam, was that you? I think the backup batteries are struggling to cope. Hang on a sec. Oh, no. I'm fear. Oh, I'm a wee scared man. Oh, okay. I've switched off a few other systems. Seems to have helped. I don't know how much longer this will last. We need the EFR online. Just, just a wee scared man there. <sighs> right, uh, where am I? So it should be this way? No, wait, what one's that? What's the hatch? Ah. A laptop. Oh man, I'm floaty. I'm really floaty. Technical diagram of the EES hatch door schematic layout. Okay, this allows the Emma. I'm talking. I should have remembered that she was tutorial tutorialing me. Right, schematic. Oh, I camera mode. Uh, 
Aye. So... Do I use it up on this? Aye, right. Oh, I literally have... Right, right, hold on. So... So, up three, along five, down one. Wait, what? Or is it the other way they want me to do it? Hold on. Oh, sorry, each one is a code, right? Hatch open, hatch close, hatch unlock, hatch lock, right, right, I see. So I want to unlock it, so I want to do L3. So that's... If I fall down and two in, I go left one, up two, left three, down four. No, Jesus man, my brain. <laughs> so, left one, up two, left two, down three. Right. Three. Let's just fucking see what happens. No? Was that no... Thought that was it. Was that no it? That looks fucking right to me. No! Opposite direction. That's what it was. I wasn't looking at the direction of the arrows. Cool. Back to the sphere. And we go. Yes, one, I have arrived. Big pimping. Hey, what we got? Ooh! Experimental fusion reactor. My favourite, this is where I want to be. I have no idea how that thing works. It was something Josh was working on. Fuck me, look at this. <laughs> You're pretty much on your own, I'm afraid. That's Do fine. Can, just get it online. Right, here we go. Let's have a good look at this. Enable containment, inject plasma. So that's off, there's no plasma. Plasma magnet, system timeout. Adjust magnet strength, redirect power. So let's see, right, enable containment. Inject plasma. And then... Alright, so I've got a time limit for it. Uh, can I highlight... Wait. Oh, I see. So I want a... No, no, no. Big. Oh, no, no, no. Right. Get it into the circle. Is that my... My goal here? Is that moving it? Is that actually moving it? Oh, hold on, hold on. Can I turn it off? Disconnect. Disconnect that. I I I assumed that the kinda the wobbly bit with the plasma that I had to get it kinda within the circle. But the magnets didn't seem it didn't seem to be changing it. Maybe they weren't, I wasn't just noticing it. Let's see. Try that again. I, I assumed I maybe had to get it to run run here or maybe just within there. Um So wait, if I go to... what one is it? Magnet, Strength and Peak. So that's... Right. So wait, if I bring this one... No, bring it down. Or if I increase it... 
Right, right, there we go. So I want to increase them and pull it out into a nice shape, maybe. Maybe a stable shape. No. Um. Maybe it is the opposite then. Bringing them in to get it to the middle. It's about a time out anyway, it's kind of fucking... Aye, that might be the... That looks a bit more... Correct, actually. Let's try that. Fucking that's looking a bit better. Safe and then a wee bit more to pull that out. No. Oh. Yeah, right, cool. That's cool. That's very cool. You've done a cool thing. I'm running low on oxygen, so let's get a move on. There's a Scotland flag. Fuck me, man. Right, hold on, replay that. Right, circle. Right, right, cool. This is fucking mental and I love it. Circle. Fucking. Oh. Fuck. Um. That. That. No. What, oh, fuck. What was the last one? Shit. I was near. Hold on. Right. Hydrogen esque symbol. Reverse tick. Right. Then they stack of boxes. Uh, 
you were doing this if you are doing this but I need you to help me Sam I need to know what is going on I need the crew the power is back but the hatch to Universal is still offline I need you to find out what the problem is Sam give me a systems diagnostic Man, this game. Module UN1, hull contact points to EAS3 are unresponsive. This sounds bad. Okay, so the power is fine, but the hull connection points are misaligned. That we can fix. I can't. Hey, I Andy. Here, I loved stories untold. I believe it's outside. free on the Epic Store right now. It's like you're going on your first spacewalk, Sam. Before you go oh shit, outside, we're gonna... though, we need to update your sphere firmware to allow for exterior use. To upgrade, you'll have to scan the barcodes in EAS 11. Once you're fully updated, we'll get you outside. I'm granting you EVA permission now. The internal airlock hatch is now open. Right. So... Scan sphere HVC, HVC codes in ES11. Right. Which direction? We're in there. Uh, is this 11? Sorry, that. I thought that was just hands sticking out the wall there. Any day in a minute. Uh, what one am I in? Oh no, that's 10, right? Wait, so if that's 10, this is 9, then 11 is to my right. Right, there's barcodes, did it say? Oh, oh I'm a floaty boy. Airlock controls. Oh, is it that I need to go here for the spacewalk? Oh no, it says the code's in ES11. Um, but do I need to be on one of these first? Now that requires the upgrade. Have I went past them here? Oh, any of this shit? Man, the camera's freaking me out. Oh, there we go. To allow for maximum mobility and protection from the vacuum of space, there are a minimum of three sphere upgrades for additional abilities helpful in carrying out the relevant work. Prior to the extra extra vehicular activity, scanning the appropriate upgrades with the sphere in EES 11 will allow new firmware to be applied, enabling these features. Using a terminal or placing a request on SAM, users may combine the script compiler with all feature scripts to apply. Once applied, these features remain permanent and require a full reboot to remove. So light, speed, and signal. Oh, what was that? Uh, high variation code that provides Sam with the sphere upgrade. 
This must be combined with an appropriate compiler in the SAML. So just scan each one of these. And then apply the bastards. Data combination now available. Combine files in the memory core. Right. Uh, combine files in the memory core. Here we go. Ah, look at this. Um. Hold on. So it's what was that one again? There we go. Great, that's you all set up. Okay, get those module clamps fixed, Sam. Right, so I'm a big magic boy now. Out we fucking go. Oh no, local sphere. I was already. I was already in local sphere, so. Let's see, right. Airlock controls. Pressure controls disabled, your lock not sealed. Oh, wait, do I need a. Um... Oh, no, wait, that's the same bit. Oh, look, I've got a boost. Sorry, I just noticed that, look. Cool. Um... Ooh, oh, floating. And then we can pressurise it. Not depressurise it. And then external the hatch. Where you can rearrange the clamps is on the outer hull of EAS. -3. Oh fuck me, this is no, this is US twelve while we're out here. This is um this is like one of Guy's big fears. It's like the idea of being in space, but being being outside of a, a space station type thing with nothing actually connecting you to it. That's like so fucking terrifying. The notion, the notion of not even having like a wee tether. Oh, look at that. I'm seeing it big feet. It's funny in it to say this is a big fear of mine, like it's ever a possibility. <laughs> <laughs> Aye, there. Why would I feel that? It's not going to happen. Hey, a man can dream. Right, 12. She says we might as well investigate 12 while we're here. Which one? Oh, fuck me, right, don't. Aye, that's the way I come out. We are at ES9. So... There's 8. So is it run the other side? What we got run Oh, that'll be twelve. Can I Sam, go in here? It's still there. Right. We can check it out. Let's see. Oh, we go it. Emma, I'm in my suit. I don't know what is happening. I was trying to unlock the door after the lockdown and the module started shaking and then... Sam, jettisoned the module. Oh. God, Sam jettisoned the fucking module and he shouldn't be able to do that. I'm going to try and work my way around the station exterior. Ah, shit. Did she hear that? Did she hear that or did only I hear that? Wait. Can I go into it? Oh no, I can't. <laughs> no cursing on the station, please. Hey man, we're professionals. 
Great. Let's... Is that it? Just that bit? Don't think there's anything else up here with the looks yet. What's that? What? Is that just wee bits of debris? There's a wee thing there. I'm so fucking freaked out. He said he was going to try and make his way around the outside of the station. Ah, this is wild. So how would I relay that information to her? What is that? A big wardrobe. I'm freaked out. I'm freaking out. There's nothing else in there, was there? Right. Where am I going? ES3 hatch clamps. Okay. Oh fucking K. Right. What have we got down here? If I can just see one for a point of reference, that'll give me a better idea. Straight down, Sam. The controls are at the bottom of the EAS arm. No, I don't know, though, then. She's saying straight down, but is that relative to where I am right now? And look, the map doesn't fucking exist out here. What one am I looking at? What one are you? Where's the fucking codes that were on the side of them? I'm freaking out. Wait, why have they suddenly no get the... Identifying markers. Wait. Why is it not telling me what one I'm looking at? Tell me. What the one he's saying? Previous instruction. Sam, get those clamps disengaged. I'll be watching your feed. Wait, she said down. Clamps disengaged. Is that... Right, that's 12, isn't it? The, right, I Right, sorry. I'm just... I'm trying to get my bearings again. That's the bit I came out, which was in ES11. So if I'm coming down these... Here's ES2. So that one must be 3. Getting closer. Look for the controls on EAS-3. Oh. All contacts. That looks good. Oh, right, um... So it's two, four, and eight. Ah, oh, nice. I see, I see how we do.
Oh, shit. Shit. I was, I was getting ahead of myself. I was trying to act the big spaceman. Where do we go? That's it. The whole connection points are reading true. I think that's working. Yeah, it's working. It's gonna take a few minutes while the module connection runs its pressure checks. Sam, while you're out there, take a closer look at the damage you detected earlier on the station exterior. What can you see? Wait, what? What? The exterior is quite large. Like, you're gonna have to be more specific with the, the damage I noticed. Um. Damn it. Oh, wait. Oh, right, it was satellite damage, wasn't it? Oh, that's one of them. That's one of the things, I think. And the other one was uh, solar panels. I'm saying satellite, I meant fucking solar panels. Pretty sure this is one of them. Maybe? I thought that was one of them, because I looked up, didn't I? Right, they, that's definitely one of them. Go and see them. Oh, wait, if it's them, then is it... Oh, that's 12. Space is fucking terrifying. Can I know... Can I examine? She wanted me to check out the dam- uh, That's fucking damage. That's definitely damage. Ah, that's the one I'm thick because that's just a connector. That's actually damaged and that bit's fucked. Was that the bit I was looking up at then? I feel like doing there via the camera. Know that bit. I didn't seem to be bothered with that. This bit? Does this mean anything, Emma? Emma? Wait, Emma, I'm hitting into an invisible wall. In space! Motherfuck. <laughs> An unknown material is present at hull fracture points. That looks like what I found in EAS-4. What the heck? Oh, that sticky weird shit. Bring the sphere back inside and meet me in EAS-3. Shit, Let's low power levels. I hope to God the others are okay. Do you know, it's quite good actually, because see that? That EAS-12, that kind of functions as a an anchor point. To get an idea of where I was. Well, of where I'm going anyway. Where does she want me? Oh, well, I'll be able to see where she is once I'm in. Safe. No, wait, we're well, no safe yet. No yet. Hey, close you. Get repressed. Beautiful. Oh, fuck me. Right, the sphere's bug up. Right, so can I interact with it for here? No, I know this angle. Neither of them. Neither. Right, ne right what's what? Captain's module, Emma's down there. Can I just go and see her here? The hatch lights are on. Looks like the connection to Universal is holding. Scotland! No. Forever! Hatch, please. This one.
Right, we want to unlock, so it's three. This one again, innit? Eh, uh, so we go over there. Oh, yeah. Okay, that's it open. Here we go. Here, let me. Hello? Elsa? May? Stars? Jim. Maybe they're all doing in Saturn having the party and they're saying, bring her. Bring her to the party. Why is the link door closed? Uh, I'm freaking out. Josh. They frozen so fucking so solid. Looks like it was exposure. It must have been depressurized at some point before. Sorry, mate. Fuck, I'm so sorry. That's your universal camera systems back online now. So keep an eye out for anything while you work. Right, so I can go ES at Universal Camera. Oh! May, it's Emma. You have no idea how happy I am to hear you. Emma. Oh my god, Emma, I'm stuck in Shenzhou. Where are you? We've just made it to Central. Who is we? Me and Sam. I don't know where anyone else is yet except. except Stas. He's dead, May. Looks like Central depressurized. It's okay now, though. Uh, he's in his suit, but I, I don't think he had O2. What about Jim? Josh? Ailsa? Nothing yet. We had like a full power outage. Sam has lost most of his functions, and we're slowly getting him back up to speed. Okay. I'd like to help, but I'm stuck in the Chinese arm. There's something wrong in UN3. It's all locked down. I'll get Sam to look into it right now. Sam, check the station alerts. Make that the priority if you can. Right. <laughs> Fix high priority station alerts. Oh, fuck me, man. It's really opening up, isn't it? Aye, so there's the, the Eastern one. Universal. Oh no, Eastern, European and American Space Agency, Universal, the Russian arm, the Shenzhou arm that's Chinese. Oh. I might, I might caught a night there. I might caught a night there. Because I think if I try and do this in a one-hour, it will be very long, so I might, I think I'd rather do it in two. Two goes. But this is fucking good. I'm really feeling this. Aye, ankle. Caught a night there. Let everybody rest for the fucking horror. You know, for space mentalness. 
Oh, Christ. Cheers for joining me, boys and girls. Take care of yourselves, brush and floss your teeth, wash your arse. Uh, don't go on a spacewalk. And just, you know, be the best person you can be in your day-to-day -day life. Take care. Night-night. From space. <laughs>